Hey guys, how's it going? Aurora will have a great 2024 and yes, I do hold a position in Aurora and uh, I may sell it or buy more at, you know, depending on the price of the stock and yes, I am aware that there's a possibility that Aurora could do a reverse split if it doesn't break a dollar and unless big money or a bunch of retail investor comes in and decides to pump it over a dollar because retail has the ability to pump this thing over a dollar if a bunch of retail investors get it up or decide to just keep buying the stock yeah it could pump over a dollar but unless that happens or we are institutions the hedge funds this stock is not going to uh break a dollar and the reverse split might happen so that's the biggest risk factor for Aurora but regardless of that the fundamentals of the company will be really good in 2024 because uh, they are expanding into Germany and that's a uh, very good for you know and then when Germany opens up there's a possibility that other countries could you know open up uh, recreational and Aurora's facilities are all, EG, are all EU GMP certified so they can potentially grow it and ship it overseas and then they also have a facility in Germany so that will help them you know make a market in Germany because of their facility in Germany uh, and if we look on the balance sheet right they have a total cash 128.9 million plus uh, 63 million dollars in restricted cash and then uh, if we look at uh, liabilities for debt loans and borrowings 13 million dollars that's uh, current and then long term I guess are uh, other loans and borrowings of 34 million 34.5 million and nothing else there's no more uh there's no more debt i i don't know what these other long-term liabilities are or deferred tax liabilities are i'm not really an accountant but i know that debt is not that bad and then on top of that they also raised another 38.8 .8 million dollars of uh of cash on October 3rd 2023 so that adds to their cash position which is currently sitting at over 227 million dollars of cash on the balance sheet so this one was on October 3rd which was just right before the earnings report so they have a lot of cash on their balance sheet and then we look at their financial statements uh, they currently currently just pushed into the into the black um, hold on oops right here income before taxes 384 million dollars so no sorry three hundred eighty four thousand dollars so they're pushing into the black and you know so the, the the stop the bleeding they have a decent cash on their balance sheet and hopefully they go cash flow positive in um next year like in 2024 and be consistently cash flow positive which uh, uh, is good and the company is not going bankrupt because they still have a liquid stock they have a lot of cash on the balance sheet they have very little debt and they have stopped the bleeding and possibly go cash flow positive in 2024 I don't know how much by cash flow positive but Germany is coming online and the fact that they're already cash flow positive could increase the revenue and possibly push them into 
nice profitability which could excite the market and pump their stock but this might happen before the reverse split unless you know big money and retail investors decide to pump the stock pass over a dollar and hold it for at least 10 days anyways thanks for watching guys i hope you enjoyed this video have a great day bye